At the moment, we don't really have any mechanism for finding definite integrals. They are areas under curves, a fact that might serve us well in a certain very limited situations. For example, if we want to compute to the integral from zero to three of two x dx, we could do this as a geometric argument. Two X is a straight line. The area under the curve is therefore the area of a triangle. And the area of a triangle is one half the base times the height. So when x is three, two x is a six, the base is three then, the height is a six. Let's see, 18 divided by two. This area is nine. But this really does kind of fall into the, into the category of problems that were lab grown to work out well. I mean, once we get to the next section and learn better techniques, I don't know that we'll ever again want to use a geometry to compute a definite integral. Even so, let's go ahead and do this second example. It's maybe less intuitive what this graph is geometric. But if we square both sides and assuming we remember the circle formula, x squared plus y squared equals four is a circle centered at the origin with radius two. Be careful though, why is this square root? And square roots are always positive. So we only have the positive semicircle and the positive semicircle does run from negative two to positive two. And this integral 
is then the area under the curve, one half times pi times the radius squared is two pi.